Hi and welcome back to the channel and thank you so much for clicking into this video. So in this video, I am going to teach you how to fix AMD Ryzen Master Driver not installed properly error. So make sure that you stay until the very end of this video so you don't miss any important step or information. And without further ado, let's get on it. So I'm going to teach you different methods on how you can possibly fix this issue. The first one is to check for your device driver. So as the error message suggests, the Ryzen Master not installed properly problem is related to certain drivers. So we recommend you to install the latest correct AMD related drivers before proceeding. And to do that, you can check for driver issues manually via the device manager or a professional check tool like driver EC. So since a user from the AMD community reported that the error can be resolved by installing the latest AMD chipset drivers, you can have a try. So for the steps, what you need to do is to simply press the Windows plus R keys on your keyboard to open the run dialog box and then type dev mgmp dot mse so again it is the dev mgmp dot mse and hit the enter button or key on your keyboard to open the device manager so just expand the each category inside device manager and look for the drive mark with a yellow exclamation mark icon so it indicates there is a driver issue so after that just right click the driver or the device driver and select update driver just right here and we and here we take the AMD Ryzen driver for example so select the search for automatically for drivers right here and follow the on-screen prompts to complete the installation. So alternatively, you can visit the manufacturer's website and download the latest AMD chipset driver and install it manually. And once done, you can relaunch the utility and set NRC if the AMD Ryzen master driver not installed problem gets solved. And for the next method, what we have here is to perform a clean boot. So many users reported that some software may conflict with the AMD master Ryzen or Ryzen master utility. So if you have third party software installed recently, you can try uninstalling it to check if the error can be fixed. And if you're not sure if or which software is causing the conflict, you can perform a clean boot so this is because a clean boot enables windows to boot with minimal set of drivers and start a program so that you can verify which programs are conflicting and for the last method what we have is to make some changes using the registry editor so it has been proven by some users that deleting the file or deleting the registry or using the registry editor by making some changes so it can fix the error so let's give that a try so these are all the steps that you need to do so first just press the windows plus r keys to open the run box and then type reg edit in it and hit enter on your keyboard so just click on the yes in the confirmation window and in the registry editor window just go to the following path right here via the left navigation bar so with the AMD Ryzen master driver entry selected from the left panel, which is right here as shown in the photo, just double click onto the image path and then sell or delete the double question mark. So value before the C program files and click on to OK to save the change. So if you find the AMD Ryzen master driver v13 and amd ryzen master driver v14 entries delete them also so just now reboot your computer and and, and check if the ryzen master not installed properly error is cleared so that's it for this video those are some fixes that you can do if you are having problem with the ryzen master driver not installed properly so i hope this video helped you and if it did please make sure to like subscribe and hit the notification bell button so you don't miss a video thank you so much for watching and have a great day Bye bye